Okay, today what we're going to do is we're talking about a four-man midfield. So in blue, you have one, you have two sixes, two tens, right? So in this four-man midfield, we put a line down the center. In the video, you'll see a red dot here in the center of the field to dissect it in half. And what we have is, again, two sixes, two tens. We have a goalkeeper. We have a uh, right back, left back. As this keeper must stay off the field. These four red players do not have to be on either side. They can condense to one side of the field, try to make the field smaller. They do not have to have both sides of the field covered. So what happens is I give them free play, but we can make this two touch, one touch, whatever you want to do. As this ball is worked, can the blue team score down on this goal, which is an empty goal? You could put a, uh, you have to have eight passes before you score. It really depends what your objectives are here. If blue gives away the ball, the red team then, we have a condition, maybe they have to play back to the keeper, they build, and then they can score. Again, however you want to play this is up to you, but if blue gives away the ball, this keeper on blue comes off the field. So let's take a look at how this looked in practice. Now, I left the sound of this video on just to give you guys an idea of like what it's like in training. So as you can see, this goalkeeper is playing with red right now. Two on one side, two on the other side. There's this red dot in the middle that cuts the, the, the line in, in half. So oh, we ball. had it. Good start with Leon. Nice job. So we got make it, take it here, right? They score, they get rewarded, they get the ball back. If I'm the blue team, I'm going to try to press in numbers at the right time. So good, Jacob, Jacob, good. Now he comes on the field, this goalkeeper, as this goalkeeper comes off the field. Keeper. Good. Oh, good start with Jacob. Ball starts with the blue team here. This keeper on blue starts with the ball. This really is a 7v4 advantage for the team with the ball. Free play, it's free play. We do this exercise, one touch, two touch on the steal, two touch, free play. I want to create as many different environments that we can in a training session. I don't want them just to play one touch, just to play two touch, just to play, play your keeper. free play. Come on, Leon! Yeah. Yeah, coach is telling me 30 seconds to the end because we're doing this time. We're doing three-minute intervals in that. So that gives you an idea. This is we played with a 3-2-2-3 three, two, two, three formation this year. So here you had the two sixes and the two tens. And I didn't want these guys crossing over into each other's space. I wanted this to be more of a positional type exercise. Anyways, hope you like the video. And I hope you like the new sound edition there. Maybe I'll leave the sound on more of the videos so you guys can get a little better feel for what's going on.